Creating section views in SOLIDWORKS 2013 is now an interactive and streamlined process using Section View Assist. There's now one button that contains everything you need to do to create a section view. It's an interactive process using the Property Manager to select the appropriate orientation and all that's required is to snap to the appropriate geometry. However, there's also a pop-up menu with a variety of options for creating jogs and offsets. Let's take a look at one of these. To create a single offset, all we need to do is snap to geometry and a jog will be created. From there, we simply need to snap to what we want to cut through. You can do this as many times as you need to to get just the section view you're after. This ensures that there's no opportunity for mistakes or missing anything in your section view. Once you've selected what you want to cut through, hit OK and the options that have always been in SOLIDWORKS are made available. You'll notice that through this process we didn't have to draw any sketch geometry, inference any geometry on the model, or create any sketch relations to get the section view we're looking for. This is all done by simply snapping to the relevant geometry on the screen, streamlining the process significantly. We also mentioned that there's only one section tool now. The one section tool now encompasses the ability to incorporate aligned section views by simply toggling a button. From here we select the center of the view or what we want to section and specify the initial orientation, in this case vertical, and then set the aligned angle. Much like the section view we did before, there's options for creating offsets. Arc offsets are a great way to complement the aligned section view. Like before, these will automatically snap to geometry, allowing us to specify the arc position and what we want to cut through. When these are set, simply hit OK and choose the options you need and let SOLIDWORKS create the view for you. Like before, where we didn't need to create any sketch geometry, we also don't have to worry about the order in which we select it. And this comes to our last section view we'll want to create. A half section is something we've always been able to do inside of SOLIDWORKS, but again, required appropriate sketch geometry and appropriate order of selection to get it just right. We simplify this process with a new half section option where all we need to do is select the center of the section and press OK. SOLIDWORKS does, takes all the complication out of it for us. This is a great way to show the interaction between external and internal components of a complex design. As you can see, Section View Assist greatly simplifies the process of creating new section views in your drawings, allowing you to get more done in less time.